Uh, I'm here at Atmosphere America 2018 with Andre Passenaud from Emerson and we're going to talk about what Emerson is bringing to the show and some more information about their industrial uh, units and their light commercial units as well. So Andre, if you can give us some overview of what you're presenting here at Atmosphere sure. and also your big news about natural refrigerants. Sure, there's a couple of things going on. Uh, what I'm presenting at Atmosphere is I'm part of the uh, trends panel. So I'll talk about some of the food retail trends and how suppliers have to adapt to those five major trends. So I'll touch on that. And then I'm also doing a case study on integrated display cases um, and compare that to CO2 systems. So R290 display cases in a small store versus CO2 uh, transcritical in a small store. So that's what I'll be speaking of this conference. You asked about uh, new products, and Emerson being a global company, we're involved in new products all the time uh, because of global dynamics that are happening. We play in the residential AC space, the food service space, food retail, we're even into transport and industrial. So what I've chosen to talk about is basically two spectrums, the smaller food service food retail space on R290 integrated displays, cases, and where we fit in the industrial space, what's going on there. So if we take the R290 space, um, from a solution point of view, we get approached often by equipment manufacturers to help them complete a solution. So if I give the example of an integrated display case from R290 for propane, uh, Emerson has scroll compressors that are suited for R290. But we also have the electronic expansion valve, the filter dryers, the sight glasses that go with it, as well as the electronic controls. So we can marry that complete solutions package for, an, for a uh, case manufacturer, for example, in integrated display cases. And when you take that information from the case level and push it out to a supervisory control that manages all the cases in the stores and pushes it out to a cloud for remote communications. So basically you're delivering a package to it's OEM. A solution package for that OEM, which happens to have all of our products and also some of the electronic integration wrapped around it. Okay, brilliant. Um, and maybe if we can talk about the new industrial system as well sure. that you have. Yeah, we're pretty excited about the uh, modular refrigeration unit, call it an MRU, was introduced, as mentioned, at the IIAR show. Uh, but really what that is, is a combination, or it can be a combination of ammonia and CO2, or it could be 100% ammonia for medium temp, or 100% CO2. So if industrial users are really trying to reduce their ammonia charges, they're not really trying to get rid of ammonia because it's an extremely efficient refrigerant, but reducing ultra low charges is important. So the modular refrigeration unit does that for, for industrial end users because it's a complete package that has an evaporator section and a mechanical section right next to each other, all built within a same framework that sits on the roof for various capacities. Mm -hmm. So you can have a medium temp version, or you can have a low temp version. You can have it all ammonia, or you can have it combination of ammonia and CO2. So it gives people like that flexibility of what kind of system they want. Absolutely, whatever their comfort level is, whatever they're looking for from efficiency, wherever they are geographically may have mm -hmm. a, uh, a decision in that, in that uh, selection process. Uh, and also capacity. You are limited to certain size capacities. So if you have an extremely large warehouse, you'll need more than one. You need several from a distribution point of view. Okay. All right. Well, thank you very much, Andre, for your time. Um, and if you want any further information about Emerson's products, you can just check them out online.